My name is Rachel Garcia. I am a junior from Derby High School. My name is Sai Vidor Central Nathan. I am from America. My name is Hope. I'm from Ohio in the U.S. My name is Jared Smith. I'm here in West Tech University as part of a school trip where we go around China and experience the culture and stuff like that. We got off the bus and then we went to the do our dormitories for where, where we're going to stay. We took a small tour of the campus. I thought it was it was very nice. I really liked how evenly the buildings were spaced out and how much how much greenery there was, how much space there was for people to walk around and stuff. It all looked very modern compared to back home. I really liked the like style, how it looks and how the students seem to decorate a lot of the places where they hang out. I think that's very cool. Also love the culture of like how nice they are. They've all been so welcoming, so nice, so accommodating. It's a very nice campus. It's very spacious. It's very beautiful. The dorms are really nice. If I had an ideal campus, well, like this would be definitely an ideal campus. Then we went to the one of the canteens. They have like four canteens here. It's a really big campus. Oh, it's been very delicious. We've tried a bunch of food here that I've never tried before. It was my first time having duck. I had some veggies. I uh, had some fish, which was very good. I had to debone it though, but that was that was interesting. Then we went on a tour to go see different labs. I thought the robotics one was pretty cool because they were kind of like a bunch of individual robots all like working together to form different shapes and things and they were telling us they were walking us through the improvements they made from their first um, tests they were extremely advanced from what I saw for a college lab I know they mentioned that this was like a, a research a research college but I didn't realize how advanced it would be like they were converting water into clean hydrogen and oxygen to use for energy and storing it in a more efficient way. And they were also using microchips to be implanted in your brains to like have a constant EEG monitor so you could predict seizures and other sort of different medical uh, conditions to a more precise degree. I thought that the area that was talking about microchips was really interesting in the engineering section. We got to look at what some of them look like and they talked to us a little bit about how they conduct some of their experiments. Yeah, I, I can't imagine anything like this being done to such this degree at some universities in the United States. States. So I want to do something with music and STEM, like a dual major or something that goes hand in hand in, in both the areas. I think it's a very cool place actually. If I were going into like chemistry, for example, I think I would choose to come here. I made a lot of friends, so yeah, I'm, I'm definitely, I definitely plan on com coming back in the future, maybe study abroad.